Uh, so welcome back guys my name is Amlan and in today's make launch free campaign we go about looking at how to use power saving options on a Samsung phone. Now this is the Samsung M31s and let's look at how you can enable deep power saving on this phone. This can be pretty helpful for saving battery. So let's look at how this is done. I head towards the uh, mobile settings. So basically I swipe from the top, tap on the settings icon, scroll down until I see device care. So like I see this device care and you can see that there is a battery option here. Anyways, I go here and then there are several options, one of which is battery. I tap on battery. Now inside battery, you will see there is this power mode. Now tap on power mode. Uh, by default, it is selected to optimized. And this, well, it gets the recommended balance. Everything is fine, but in case you are looking for maximum power saving, so how do you do that is by tapping on this and it says that the CPU speed will now be limited to 70% and always on display will be turned off. Brightness will be set down by 10%. You can again customize this. So like you can see the estimated battery life uh, would be four days, four hours. So well, let me go ahead and apply this. I mean, so we have turned on the maximum power saving mode so and you can see what on uh, gets done in process. So this is all fine. So there you go. Maximum power saving mode has been turned on and this is how the screen looks. Uh, well, these are like the only apps by default which run. You can obviously add on to this list. So if you want to make something work, you can bring that app as well here. Now it's quite possible that you may want to kind of, you know, uh, go out from this maximum power saving mode simply tap on this three little dots and turn off power saving So there you go. The maximum power saving mode will be turned off now Please do note that this is different from ultra power saving. So like in case uh, Like you are entering into power saving mode. This is what needs to be done So It's all done now. You can see the mobile has returned to normal now I will just swipe from the top, tap on the settings icon and I just want to show you one more thing. So as you go to this uh, device care, you can see uh, right at the bottom there is this ultra data saving but I do need a SIM for that. Now not on all devices do you have uh, like you know the uh, battery options like we saw. So this is Samsung M51s, swipe from the top, tap on the settings icon, uh, head towards the battery device care and here if I go to battery you can see. I have power saving mode simply like you know if I tap here like how I have power mode uh, several different options I don't have that I can simply turn this on and everything that happened will happen other than that I do have ultra data saving mode so like I can just turn this on now this is something very different it uh, like uh, blocks the background data for apps and compresses data using Samsung Max and you will see there is not much difference like you know once this is there like the phone behaves almost normal so there's nothing much there to it but if I go to like you know battery device care and I go to battery and I go to power saving mode this is when the magic actually happens so like the same thing however you don't get those three options like you saw, saw, saw on that other device but anyways I want to come out of this right now so I just turn off power saving so anyways, I just hope that now you know how to turn on maximum power saving for Samsung devices. In some devices, it just happens automatically. And in some devices, like you need to select the maximum power saving. What I mean is like in devices like this, you basically go to battery and you can simply turn on power saving mode. And in some cases, like even if you go to battery, uh, like inside battery, you have this option of power mode wherein you need to go and select the maximum power saving thing. So hopefully all this helps. If it does, kindly consider subscribing. Uh, also, please do share this with your friends and family. I believe this tutorial will help you uh, in saving battery life. And that should be all from my side. Until next time, it's me, Amlan, signing off. Goodbye. Have a great day.